Johnny, football was a funny old game. I bet 84 minutes in, you didn't expect to be standing there after a 2-2 draw. No, I didn't. Um, yeah, we got ourselves into a great position in the game, uh, deservedly so. Um, and you think yeah, we we're, were in a really strong position now to go and see it through, get the three points. Uh, scored two good goals and was in the ascendancy in the game. But um, we obviously let them back in. Uh, we had a poor, poor five minutes there at the end that's cost us. How frustrating is it for you for that to happen after what happened against Gillingham as well, sort of a similar set of circumstances with two late goals? Yeah, it's really frustrating. Um, obviously, we didn't score against Gillingham, so you're always leaving yourself open. But today mm. we've got two goals, um, you know, a decent cushion there, pushing for, for you know opportunities for more, especially in that second half. And uh, so to not see it through is obviously uh, yeah really frustrating. Yeah, obviously Nathan came on and got the two goals. Um, is that exactly the sort of impact you, you asked from him when you were you know, giving him instructions before you went on? Yeah, of course. Um, he, you know, he's, he's been great since he's come in with us, Nathan, and he's sort of had to buy his time for opportunities. Uh, joined us a little bit late, um, but he's been excellent. Obviously, he knows, strikers know that there's always a chance they're going to come onto the pitch, and he was ready. Uh, he knew what was required of him, and obviously, he impacted the game really well. So, delighted for him. Uh, yeah, really, really pleased. And obviously, when you are making substitutions, you you are looking for those sort of impacts. Would you say that was Ayub Sal's best performance in this formation? Yeah, I would. I would. I just say the lad was outstanding, um, especially in that second half. I thought he caused him all sorts of problems. Um, and he really, he, you know, he really stepped up. So uh, we're you know, ple pleased for Ayub and his form, and someone who you know is just you can tell that he's enjoying his football. Uh, he's being very creative. And he just causes a lot of problems for the opposition. So we yeah, are really, really, really happy with him and his form. Mansfield coming up next. Have you had much chance to to sort of look ahead to that one, or is it, is it literally just game by game? It's been a little bit game by game. Obviously, with the schedule, having a midweek game means that it focuses on Gillingham and then then our Doncaster today. But obviously, our, our focus now will we'll turn to that game. Um, you know, we're, we're we're three games in now. We're unbeaten. Uh, it's a decent start. Obviously, we, you know we would have liked more today, um, but we're really confident in, in where we're at, what we want to do. Obviously, there's loads of things that we can work on and improve, uh, and we'll, we'll continue to do that and strive to be better.